Welcome back to our Final Fantasy VII Rebirth playthrough. If I uh, actually select the game and not my settings. <laughs> I'm having to remember how to stream. I've had a couple of days off. Please, please wait. How dare you make me wait. In squeaky chair. Uh, so, we were still in the coral area. We were doing... All the side content, as always. Oh yes, I just come away from being frustrated with stupid summon fights. Not that I will be doing any of them. Whoa, 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 whoa. How amazing do my chocobos look? That is pretty darn amazing if I do say so myself. Right, anyway, let's go. I'm digging the uh, choke about theme here as well. Must be a nice way up to the factory there. We go. Oh, interesting, Zeno. Any any reason as to why? Something gone wrong? Wanted to do the trust me, I'm an adult joke. No worries. Ooh, we can transmute to Fortress Bracer. Uh, ooh, that's a nice little upgrade. Wait. Bear with me.
sorry about that, I am back. Oh, okay, the game is like telling me what I can. Now, well, it does tell me I could make a bunch of stuff. And that's like, no, no, you can't. Weird. Yeah, he's fine, Zeno. Nothing to worry about. All I'm saying is we find everything much faster if we cloned ourselves, too. No. Shut up, Faye. Just think, you could start a mercenary franchise. And I could even help you set up a branch in Wutai. Plus, Shinra wouldn't stand a chance against a cloud army. You and your buster sword-wielding buddies and hack them to bits. Yeah, right. Oh, come on. Just imagine. <laughs> One cloud, two clouds, three clouds, four clouds. Uh, I know you aren't much of a talker, but I figured at least one of you would say something. I'm not really digging this vibe. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I think I'm good with just one cloud. The one and only. Oh, I like you. She makes me chuckle, to be honest, Senna. Apparently this one is upstairs. Upstairs. No, not upstairs. things. Uh, no, it's that I need to make. Yes. That's what I'm thinking as well, Zoe. It almost looks like a taxi it. to the golden saucer, maybe. Hot, steamy showers in every room. <sighs> well, we should probably report back to Johnny now that we've bailed out all the others. Uh, actually, there's one more. <sighs> really? Where is he? Said he wanted to give the hotel royal flair by putting the Tonberry King's crown on display. Last we heard, he was desert bound. Hope he's not dying of thirst or knife wounds. You wouldn't mind going to check on him for us, would you, bro? Not at all. You're, You're the, the best. best! Well, we got a boiler to fix, so we're gonna head back. Sounds like our other life in is in your hands, tomb. bro. Mint. Go. 
Okay. I do love the music here. It's so peaceful. Ooh, this is a new is area, the borderline. I can't believe you're here, bro. <laughs> Me neither. Well, I'm glad you are. <laughs> You see, we're renovating the hotel. And I thought a Tonberry King's crown would give the place that palatial feel. But it's, uh, somewhere over there. Rumor has it, the Tonberry King lives somewhere nearby. But there's no way your boy Johnny can get through the desert on foot. Listen, bro, I don't know if you were planning to check out the dunes, but if you are, you'd really be doing me a solid if you brought me back that crown. Preferably in the most pristine condition possible. Fine. Just sit tight. I hope you know a way into the desert cloud. Because I sure don't. Over the mountains? Or something? Oh, your kindness is bringing me to tears, bro. I eagerly await your safe and fruitful Interesting return. season, eh? Just Interesting don't keep me waiting to too see. long. We Johnnies are delicate flowers that wilt in the desert heat. What? Sort of pose was that? Oh. Oh, okay. Interesting. So it looks like I might actually be stuck. So I don't think I can actually finish this one right now because I believe what we need is over here. But we're gonna have to go this way around. Ooh. Uh, we do need to go back to Costa del Sol and do this, but I suppose we should go and get this over and done with. <laughs> The mug house that I oh so love. Oh my god, as if it was right on top of it. Well, Zeno, you're gonna have to hold on to your look. I did not, I haven't read the article yet either, Zeno, so I will, I will read it. I will read it. Don't worry about that. Please bring back all the mooglets for me, Koopo. No.
I will cut you. Yes, I know. Thanks so much. <laughs> I will cut you. <laughs> Thanks so much for helping us get this Emporium open. Not many people know this, but the Emporium's founder, Mog, had a hard time learning how to fly. Oh, Interesting. Of and practiced every day until his wings finally worked. It's such an inspiring story, Koopo. We know about that mini game, don't we? From the original seven. All right, what rubbish have you got for me? Koopo. Actually sounds pretty broken. Feel free to drop by any time. Right, I suppose. We should go and get this other side mission on the go. At least the game will now let us on the beach without um, beach work. You're the one who got into it with that Shinra scientist. Oh wow, it is you! I'm Fran. And I'm Naomi. Name's Yorda. And we would like to hire you for a job. Her name was Yoda? That depends. It's simple. Girl and boy go on a date. Easy peasy, right? A date? The three of us are designers for Costa del Sol's premier fashion boutique. For our next line, we're thinking something sexy. Perfect for the beach, the bar, or in the boudoir. Oh. But creatively speaking, it's been a struggle. We've been racking our brains forever. And the showcase is basically now. It's do or die, and we don't want to kill our careers. So, that's where you come in. Uh, we want to see no, a real couple nothing at all, Zeno. For inspiration. Well, sound like a good As of yet, anyway. Yeah, let's take it. We knew you would. And so, we've already planned the perfect date for lovebirds like you. Get rowdy at Run Wild. Be ready to swashbuckle at Pirate's Rampage. This is going to be your best date yet. We'll make sure of it. Mate. I love how it's there if that we're um This is one of the stranger jobs you've accepted. Still a job. I'll take the lead. Hey, I can help. I'll make this date our best yet. We can just keep it simple. And what's I'm a simple date? Guessing more because more? I picked Aerith right at the beginning of the game to Across go on that um, up the clock sure. tower thing. Ah, as uh, uh up the clock tower thing is the Maybe reason the why we're always with her on these dates. <laughs> Look who it is. So, are you ready to aim and fire? Do well, and you might just land a bullseye on her heart. Hmm, mint. 
Yes, we know. Oh. Okay, this is new. Let's go. Oh, I hit him. I think that was pure luck. I only scored eleven thousand. Nah, All fine, right, thanks. not bad. Though I'm pretty sure I've got better aim. Now here's a woman who knows how to hunt for a man. I like. I'm better with a sword. She never once took her eyes off her man, and the way she stared at him, the score didn't matter. Thanks, cuties. That was just what I needed. I'll head back. Now that the creative juices are flowing again. Yeah, I you two, however, that, still have a date to finish. Go find Naomi at Run Wild. Run Wild, Run Wild. Oh, that's the football game with red, isn't it? I wonder what the girls have next on the agenda for us. More cheap date ideas? Oh, lighten up. We're trying to enjoy ourselves. You're no fun at all today. Well, for the record, I do need to, I wish you would. Do I need to check in with Johnny while I'm here? No. Oh, the green arrow is wrong. I know. Someone took their sweet time, I see. Better hurry or the game will start without you. What game? Run wild, of course. Tell me you've heard of it. It's only the hottest sport in town. Not hard to guess why, seeing all those cutie wooties. Cutie I mean, woodies. it's the perfect spot for a date. Are you ready to go? Oh my god. Okay. All right. Wish me luck, okay? Three minutes you know to this do is it. Animals, right? Not people. People are technically animals too. Right? She's so not that's wrong. Cool. wrong. Not cool. 
Oh. What? I really can't compete? No, but your pet can. And though I take umbrage with that young creature, I'm happy to offer my assistance. Fred's <laughs> got this. <sighs> well, I guess we'll just have to be the cheer squad. That was actually pretty cute. Oh, get in there. Oh, piece of shit. This is actually a lot harder than it looks, oh my god. This sucks. Oh, Jesus. There's more... Oh, this is all terrible. How on earth am I meant to get it in there? Seriously? Oh, this mini game can go and suck my nuts. Wait, 
There's a lot. Oh my god, as if I'm not being lucky. Bit. Really? Where's the fucking black ball? There it is. I, I'm not doing with that time. Wait, you've got to do, oh my god, you've got to do them in number order as well. Hey, Blacker, how's it going? Good to see you. Just get in the fucking net, you tart. There we go. That is horrible. You are like a red bolt shooting across that field. I am quick on my feet. The but three of us should I go around take a bracelet. Wouldn't that be fun? <laughs> if you enjoy losing. Hmm. Their dog is the glue that binds their relationship. And watching their little guy give it his all out there only serves to strengthen their bond. You'd, you'd like a Barrett wrestling mini game, though, wouldn't you, Mark? I've got to get this idea down <laughs> on paper. I need to get back to the shop, like yesterday. Yord is at the stables for the final part of your date. So what are you waiting for? Get those tushies on a chocobo. What sort of design the girls are going to come up with? Hey, what kind of swimsuit would you huh? want to see? <laughs> Me? <laughs> yes, you. I'm curious. Well, I prefer function over the form. Best way to so, make tracks durable. Is on uh, uh, made she with not absorbing turn materials turn that allow... There you are. Okay, I've got a great activity for you. 
If so the idea so. is to ride Kaima here and enjoy a romantic stroll along the beach. <laughs> you that on the its own sounds like a vibing. huge yawn fest. So try hunting for shells while you're at it. How about you bring me the largest one you can find? Sound good? I'll be chilling back here. So you two run along and have yourselves one shell of a time. One shell of a time. I don't know about you, but this is definitely a first for me. You've ridden them before. <laughs> I'm not talking about the chocobos. Oh. You meant the ship? Um... Go about firebolt, bolt fire blade, or whatever it's called. Whoa. I see the bunnies, I see the dig. Excuse me, Chuck, but you completely missed that. Uh, so I was testing out the PS2 with the uh, with the new capture card the other day, and it works beautifully. It works better than the. Um... We should be able to find some good shells around here. But first. <laughs> Oh, oh no, oh no. Uh, what did it say? But that will be obvious. I've just remembered something that I wanted to do with Cloud as well. I wanted to change his setup a bit. Alright, seashells. Ready or not, here we come. Let's saddle up first, then search. Mainly in the that I want to give him the... Uh, material that was a button set for all. There we go. Uh, what am I going to take away? <sighs> Sw 
swap with assess. No, MP plus actually. Yeah. Because I have, um, I may have been speaking with, um, with someone about a certain enemy skill, and yeah, there's a there's a pretty wild combo that I can actually do right now. Well, not right now. If you can get something where you're not consuming too much um, AT, where you can basically revamp your ATB really quickly, you can be like just absolutely spamming the hell out of lightning. Well, yeah, exactly, Black Hat, exactly. That's one of the one of the reasons why I wanted to change cloud setup a little bit. Whoa! I don't think I've ever seen a shell this big before. Hmm. If these things are all this size, I bet the suckers who live in them would make for good eating. Wonder how they taste. <laughs> we could ask a look. It's so teeny tiny. You know, a lot of troopers take half a shell with them when they head out on missions. I know where this is going. It's meant to be a keepsake for their partner, right? A symbol of their undying love. And an omen of death for the trooper. If anyone else sees either one, some people oh, say. Oh. Also, your feet. I, 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 I do like. Um, I still think your feet's combat is probably one of the best in the game so far as well. Obviously, going f coming straight from into mission onto this, obviously have quite the advantage.
too. That's what she said. I think I should just about do it. Okay, ready to go? Are you sure? Really? Uh, let's go. Leaving the decision to me? What about you, Cloud? Are you sure? No, never. This is part where you're supposed to blurt out. I don't want to go back. I want to <laughs> stay here with you. This date's DOA otherwise. Okay, now you're just being mean. I'm not trying to be mean. <laughs> I... sorry. Oh, Cloud. You said that, are being annoying. Nothing to it, says God, I got turned into a frog. Excuse me, coming through, don't mind me. Have a you shell. So, you know, a lovely fetch mission. Having to find any neat shells out there? How is the beach? Romantic? Uh, I'm guessing this because it's three star. <laughs> Whoa! Huge, right? Dang! That thing belongs in a museum or something. I can't help but wonder what is making her smile from ear to ear like that. Is it the shelves? Or... Ha! I've got it! It's the partial I consciousness of Zach. But before I go, swing <laughs> by the fashion showcase. We want you front row center. See you there! Next time we need a chocobo, I say we right double. Can we slow down the bird? <laughs> Which would make it that much easier to take in all the scenery. I'm still steering. Oh, fine. If you've got to be the man up front. <laughs> I suppose there's a bit of travel balance that we get with uh, Cloud and Aerith are pretty, uh, pretty weird. Oh, look, it's on the beach. What should I have I expected? Be in music. Wanna shoot your shot? This swimsuit's got perfect aim. <laughs> Love might be a game, but you'll never lose in this winning ensemble. Wanna land a big catch? With this look, it'll be hook, line, and sinker. You want to get ripped? You want a hot fog? Then you better train with the best of the best! So so come come join our gym. Gym. And and Jules the absolute legend. Oh no, does that mean there's going to be I'm one so of these mini-games again? So, 
what did you think of the show? You were the inspo after all. I absolutely loved it. But the two of us didn't do anything inspo worthy. We just had fun. That's what we wanted. Happy couples get us inspired and fired up. Exactly. This place is more <laughs> than Pull just up, a speed down. <laughs> spot. It's a paradise where people come to create lifelong memories. And making sure they do is what we do best. So next time you swing by, promise to frolic in the waters, bask in the sun, enjoy our town to its fullest, and leave with a smile. <laughs> oh, sweet. Morris P. Is that cloud? Oh, hey! You trade the city for the beach, too? What are you doing here? Relaxing, really. We're on our yearly beach retreat. And commissioning this year's new singlets from these talented young women. I feel like Jules was a replacement oh, right. for Mookie. That reminds me. Stop by the training facility when you have a moment. We're in need of your particular skills. Okay. Nice. Who else gain levels? Red. Nice. So Please. Excuse me. Tour coast to Del Sol in style with our wheelies. No. I genuinely do not like the wheelies. I find them so annoying. That's cool, we unlocked it already, because we have been by. Oh, there he is. Oh, there you are. Glad you could make it. Cloud, Tifa, once a year we take a retreat to enjoy the sun and sea breeze. Nothing like getting some games in the great outdoors. What do you say? Care to sweat with us? I think I would. I haven't done a proper workout in forever. Well, we'll happily help you both become your best selves. Train with us as long as you like. You mean it? Well, I might just take you up on that. Here's a question for you, Cloud. What would you say is the key to a good workout? Uh, an unwavering resolve for gains. <laughs> we want to get swallowed the heart by. The is the strongest muscle. But I'm not too concerned about that. As you know, our passion for getting pumped up is second to none. Now let's get down to business, shall we? Let's get the down to business. The reason I wanted you to stop by? Monsters have been spotted skulking around the facility, ones. and I want them gone. <laughs> sure. Should be easy enough. Splendid. Oh, we no. can't train our bodies unless our minds are at ease. So you'll be doing all of us muscle heads a big favor. Oh no. Let's get out there and kick some ass. Someone's excited. Well, yeah. Wanted an excuse to work up a sweat, and now I've got one. Wonder what little Tifa would say. <laughs> I think she'd be pretty proud. Elemental weakness. Time 
time to burn. Game doesn't level at all. Huh? Oh, sorry. Just some mental meal prep. The ideal post workout dish. <laughs> so, you were the one behind Seventh Heaven's menu? Half was a holdover from the old donor. The better <laughs> half was mine. Oh, should I eat there more? Yeah. You snooze, you lose. Ah, it's fine, Nick. Don't worry about it. Oh, I've had to run away from where I should have been doing things. Yes, yes, I did. Here they are. Oh, I hate the jellyfish things. No worries, Zeno. Have a wonderful sleep. I've uh, forgotten what you would be to ice. Yuffie just comes in and pokes it. Eater? Soldiers can't be choosers. We ate what we were fed. Well, I used to be super picky, actually. Really? Used to be. Not anymore, though. Can't be choosers in the slums, either. What about crap? Mm, not a fan. <laughs> yeah, me neither. <laughs> Get me in the air. They put a lot of thought into making them healthy. Not much into making them tasty. <laughs> that face says it all. <laughs> you know, it's funny. What? Didn't realize it at the time, but we ate pretty good when we were kids. Yeah. Homegrown fruits and vegetables, and great chefs eager to use them. We were lucky. That's what we say, Tifa. 
Hmm, where have I missed? It's obviously over here. No, because that's the actual gym itself. I feel like I'm just being blind. We found it eventually. Hey, right, what you got for us, Jules, other than a mini game? <laughs> oh, hey there, Cloud. Diva. Heard you two took care of our little monster problem. Have you been sat on your foot by any chance, Black Hat? Now we can get back to training fiend free. Excuse me. Sorry about it. You wouldn't happen to be the one who beat these guys in a pull-up contest, would you? Uh... Watch it, rookie! Don't badmouth us! But that's mm. how it went down, right? <laughs> You're Tifa, right? After I heard how you crushed it, I knew I had to join the gym. I can neither confirm nor deny here? that I may or may not oh, have. Well, I'm wow. pretty sad mine, and I'm expecting to I'm not your sleep only fan. anytime Look. soon. All of us signed up because we wanted to be just like you. It's just as she says. Thanks to you, our female membership has absolutely skyrocketed. Needless Don't. to say, we're very grateful. I didn't really do anything. Are you kidding me? You're literally my inspiration. Which is why I... Uh, I want to challenge you to a sit-up contest. Oh, uh, boy. Right now? So you know, Amina's been training to achieve your look, Tifa. You'd be helping her measure her progress. <laughs> Let me sweeten the deal. 
If your abs prove superior, I'll add a bonus to your reward. How's that sound? Oh my god. Okay, it's one of these. Okay. Don't go easy on me, okay? Oh, Jesus. That was perfect. Just like that. Don't you ever get sore? Oh, my God. Okay, this is this is gonna be horrible. This is gonna be fun. Shut up. <laughs> Where'd that come from? You're killing it. Don't you ever get sore? <sighs> come on. Uh, next time you I see someone doing sit ups, I'm going to tell them that you've got abs of adamantine. Nobody's born with a beautiful physique like yours. I can tell you pour gallons of blood, sweat, and tears into your training. Honestly, I have calcium cannons. Sorry. Thank you. <laughs> Glad I could help. Well, actually, I was hoping that if it's not too much to ask. Would you, Tifa, be my muscle mentor? Me? Really? I don't know. By all means, you have my blessing. If you don't mind dropping by from time to time, I'm sure she'd benefit from your advice. Might as well. If that's what you want, then I'll back you up. Oh my gosh! Thanks, Coach! <laughs> what was that laugh? Muscle mentor. Has a nice ring to it. There you go, then. Your extermination fee. And is promised a little extra for helping her out. Come back whenever you want to pump some iron. You're always welcome. Oh, we got 500 XP for that. I'm now hey, curious. See whether it is just gonna stick to the same so same rhythm. Feel the rhythm, feel the rhyme. Come on, guys, it's pop slate time. Beautiful. It's almost like your muscles are singing. No, Jesus, come on, 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 was perfect. 
Off to a real bad rhythm there. If I ever see Jules again, it'd be too this is soon. Be fun. <laughs> You're killing it! Incredible form! Oh, come on. I'm not getting the rhythm into my head. Right, right. On me. Okay. I'm getting hooked. That's my issue. That was perfect. Don't you ever get sore? Just like that. Beautiful. Where'd that come from? Come on. Listen to the beeps. Truly incredible. Yeah, keep it up. You're both so stunning. Show up. I'm going to stop because otherwise I'm just going to end up going at it. Gotta do this again sometime. That's fine. I took some notes on your form, coach. Even teeth is like that. You brought shame to me. Uh, right, so we can't do anything more for the Johnny thing at the moment because we need to be somewhere over here. So I guess it's that fateful time of actually progressing in the story. Right, how are we looking for we need to take a seat. Story, you need to tell me it's not just mini games. In in your world, it's just mini games. <laughs> Coral Ropeway. Oh. Barrett's getting all grumpy. Right? So? So? That means, wherever we find Mako, we'll find Materia too! <laughs> Alright, timeout's over, team. Let's go! You know, Yuffie, when you're part of a team, you can't just do whatever you feel like. Right? Well, does that mean I better run everything by you first? Yes. So that's the game. Fine. Oh my god, Yuffie has been the obnoxious teenager. His good qualities outweigh the bad. Yeah, by how much? Like 51% good guy to 49% jerk face? Maybe a little more than that. 
So what, like a 55-45 split? Close to. <laughs> Not you two, Tifa. Well, yeah, true, Tootsie, true. I think Aerith might need a break. Sorry. <laughs> My legs are killing me. <sighs> Let's rest here. I love how Red's projecting now, Aerith there. I mean, the mystery men might slip away. Hey, I know what to do. I'll go on ahead and scout the area for us. You guys can catch up later. Well, see ya. <laughs> catch up later, my ass. I think I'd better go keep an eye on them. Barrett's not himself right now, you know? I know. Take your time, okay? No need to rush. Thanks. We'll do. Ah, I've just realized this is actually my party as well. Party selection locked. I'm fine with that. It's like, welcome to the next section of story. You are not escaping. Ooh, weapon. Cloud up, cloud up, no, it's a weapon for Aerith. Right, what have we got here? Uh, I suppose the best two days I've done this for a while. Fifteen. Uh, we've done lots of that. Oh, thanks to see I didn't miss that. Uh, I'm not doing anything for you. I'm not doing anything for you. Well, actually, red is not part of my party, but it's fine. Oh, that is definitely a, a, a nice benefit. Yeah. That's fine. Gravity definitely hit. Just try and grab all these resources. It's all about the timing, isn't it? <laughs> It's like you can't defend against those attacks. You can't defend against the attacks that are trying that are not the you know the danger triangle. But you can defend against the attacks that have the um, that don't have the danger triangle. You get what I mean. That that's that's my logic anyway. Okay, I 
feel like I'm missing something if I'm not going over that way. The music's great here. do need to. <laughs> oh, I do like that. Timeless rod. Strike an enemy and inflict stop. Okay. Because obviously I want to get her ability mastered and whatever else. So. Looks like I might have to um, give Aerith some. Let's just have a look at her equipment then. to do it. See, if I hadn't come back here, I would have missed this chest that had a really important ruby in it. You know, I could have, I could have missed that forever. And I might have been going, where can I find a ruby for this really important ultimate weapon item? so bad. Is it about the first thing I thought of uh, when I saw this was can we run along it? <laughs> Bring it. Keep it together. I got it. Make sure that I have assessed everything. Uh, right, 
equipment, equipment, equipment. Oh my god, I'm so behind on... And mules for getting to like do things like this. Uh, right, I suppose we should go this way. I can't wait to be climbing the Great Glacier and having yellow painted marks all the way. Up. Must be about due for getting a new weapon for cloud. stealing everything. Can we? No, oh, we can't keep people out of the pie, that sucks. Yeah, that's the vibe I'm sort of getting from getting from that um black hat. And it makes her invincible as well, it would seem. You sure you wanna fight? She does feel a lot more usable though with that. She really does. Shinra boxes. Efficiency bonus game. I'm a fire in my laser. I can make a new item. Mm. 
not that I'm actually going to be putting that on um, cloud right now because it, just because of the material. Still need some oregano. I'm just waiting for like any Americans in the chat to blow the mind at me saying oregano instead of oregano. <laughs> Look at this sneaky little treasure chest. It's like gold dust. This is the beacon. I'm loving these drawings. Ooh, I've got Fire and Blizzard at long last. Ooh, what a view! What a view! Very nice. I'm definitely digging walking walking around here, it's ace. <laughs> hey there we go. This has made Aerith so playable. I, uh, I may have been completely ignoring my health. Looks like we need to drop a couple of ethers on all. So we've mastered Radiant Ward, we need Wizard's Rob now. So we just need to defend. Oh, nice. You know, putting all the all the time and effort into her for her to probably die. <laughs> You know, the, the, the level of disappointment of when Aerith actually leaves party and gets turned into a kebab and you're like, oh, I really did waste my time. 
never know. Things might be different. Okay, then. <laughs> When did Aerith become like overpowered? <laughs> I know she isn't really that overpowered, but that just feels very, very broken. Exactly, Tootsie, yeah, exactly. I need to stop calling Tootsie Black Hat. Black you still holding up okay? Yeah, feeling great actually. Could do this all day. It's like, it's like someone's pulling me up. You've become one with the mountain. <laughs> Say what? Really? I did? Hey! Thanks for having me! What the hell are you doing, Red? Relax. It happens to all new climbers. If she passes out, I'll carry her. Let's go! <laughs> Oh, fantastic. You sure you want to fight? <laughs> One more shot! Get a free heal. Be strong and carry on. You spotted a shark drawing. It's almost like the really obvious things that were left for us. Uh, not needed to be noted. Oh, we took a shortcut. How dare! Uh, let's make sure we haven't missed out anything of anything exciting. Cloud just pumps Aerith off the edge of the cliff there, that would be beautiful. So quick.
busy? I'll be around. Uh, right. Disarmed. Combat. Let's put you back as the party leader. How have I not been like making like improving characters' weapons to be going? Gained a level. Nice. I tell you, hikers these days ain't got no manners. You greet each other, it's proper. Where are you? Oh, you're there. I tell you, well, I'll be. Finally, folks who've got some manners. I don't get it. Tons of folks hiking up the mountain today, and not a one of them so much as nodded my way. Even to black a of a few sick looking yep. fellas all in black, and what did I get? Silence. <sighs> I guess these days never learned to greet each other or something. Ooh, new enemy. Oh, it's the turtle things. Too bad. Oh, the block mechanic in this is great, especially if you get the perfect block as well, it works so well. Exploiting them is weakness. Just need to find a bunch of things that are weak to ice, it just so happens that there seems to be a fair number of those on this mountain.
Oh look, a bunch of Shinra monsters, thank you. All these goodies is nice. My boy. Don't overdo it. You can do it. Leave it to me. Accept it. I have Only the strong survive. Hmm, we're not looking so hot on the old health. Man, this is a beautiful place. Oh. Uh-oh. Ooh, the act construction site. trying to suck some MP from that couch, but the game wasn't having any of it. Ah, I knew that was inevitable though. Yeah, the block mechanic works really well in this game. Well, it has for me at least. You know, other mileage may vary. Right, just bear me one moment. Right, I am back. Sorry about that. 
Uh, okay. Oh boy, who have we got here? That's rude. Come on, out you go. Okay, they're dropping off the black cloaks. Interesting. Again? That's an interesting insult. Shit, birds. Right, um, why is that? I'm being an idiot. Allow me. Lightning, wind, yep. Yeah. Did I? Yes, I did. Going in. Try using it. 
Cool. Damage gated that well. Why couldn't you just stab it in the head in the first place, Cloud? Guess the Turks are back on duty, huh? Wish they'd all go on vacation. For real? Come on. We need to find the others. The next order of business is the Magnus Materia project. As you are aware, simultaneous energy spikes were detected in Mako reactors across the world. After analyzing the data from each site, we found the spikes stemmed from the arrival of visitors, unfathomably large life forms. Oh, is that a weapon? Based on available information, it would seem so. They supposedly appear when the planet is in danger. And each one carries an enormous orb of materia. More specifically, an orb from which they themselves were born. They are living enigmas, organisms dying to be understood. And finally, my dream of capturing one is within reach. <laughs> oh, what I wouldn't give to peel one flesh back, pull it apart, <laughs> oh, oh, and see what makes it tick. What? Your wish, Professor, will soon be granted. We'll all get what we want once that materia is ours. This oh, is ridiculous. Scarlet, Why know. waste time monster hunting when we're on the brink of creating the materia ourselves? I'm aware of your efforts, but it would behoove us to obtain naturally occurring specimens as well. Well, they would look good in the lobby. <laughs> Put them in the bathroom for all I care. Just leave me the carcasses. Those I'll take. Mr. 
Mr. President, please. What is this really about? Wu-Tai is after them. Well, talk about burying the lead. Heidegger, I'll need troops. My finest for the Madam Director. <laughs> Mr. President. Yes? There's a question I never had the chance to ask your father. Perhaps you could speak on his behalf. We used Avalanche's activities as a cover to sabotage our own reactors and destroy Sector 7. Your father assured us these acts were in service to the Neo Midgar project. However, the fact remains that we have yet to locate the promised land of legend or even confirm if it actually exists. Great though he was, my father was old. And in his dotage, he became rash. But while we're on the subject, there's something I've been meaning to ask all of you regarding those decisions. Why is it that none of you even tried to stop him? Shinra must change. We must break new ground, grow stronger, smarter, observe, adapt, expand, control. My father built his empire with your royal support, and I demand the same. I expect you all to prove that you are devoted not only to the company, but to me. Like the building of um, of <gasps> yeah, let me in. Who's at the door? Who could it be? <gasps> um, Elmira? Zach, right? Yeah. Where is she? Upstairs. What's going on though? I'm going to take her home. Now slow down. I've been to your place. Shinra's got it staked out. Not anymore. They have bigger things to worry about. But... And I can't leave her with you. She doesn't have a ribbon. Of course which you means can. She doesn't Just look have at Cloud. I've been taken care of. No, you haven't. Look at the state you've left her in. You didn't even wipe her face, for goodness sake. I'm sorry. Your note had me worried. And now that I'm here, I can see that I was right to be concerned. I brought a wheelchair for Aerith. But if Cloud's coming too, you'll just have to carry him. Think you can handle that? Yeah, I can do that much. That's Aerith's, uh... And it's fine. Yes, I know. It's not glass. Huh? Aerith! 
she okay? You're okay. Right, Aerith? ending. At least, that's what everyone's saying. What? What is going on? Which way do you think Midgar is? It would be east of here. That way. She was facing exactly that way as well. I wonder how my mom's doing back there. She seemed fine when I saw her. Maybe a little worried. She's gonna hate me for this. Talk to her as soon as you get home. She'll understand. Really looking forward to that conversation. What is going on? going on that that is color me interested now I've always been curious on, as if you were that close and you didn't help god damn it sorry we're late you okay <sighs> yep <laughs> really worked up a sweat it's all right so you take two words go. black hat <laughs> all clear no nasty surprises and no materia. <laughs> we managed to catch her before she could get as far as the reactor. No, you've cheated up, Barrett. the whole Barrett. reason we're here. So hurry it up, or those hooded guys will beat us to it. Hmm. I think I'll leave the party as is for now. See, you could have you could have helped us out from here. You would have heard the fighting. <gasps> Look at it. That's it. The Corel reactor. Oh, I think it's safe to say that this um, writes off the whole idea of. Um, the huge so material. What's the deal with all these creepy hooded guys anyway? They're Shinra's victims. Hmm. Well, they're in good company. I'll give them that. Hmm? How you figure? When Shinra invaded Wutai, it was pretty bad. They leveled towns, killed thousands. And when the dust settled, they forced some BS truce on us. I thought both sides wanted a ceasefire. <laughs> the old geezers at the top did, yeah. But the rest of us were pissed. They've been running Wutai into the ground for years. It was the last straw. We were done. Everyone was ready to kick those old farts to the curb. And that's when Colonel Lodbrock's team showed up. What? Three ex soldiers ready to join the cause. Oh, interesting. Lodbrock, his squad saved Wu Tai from those senile old fossils, paved the way forward. 
Interesting. So that's how he comes up. into the story. The crew was rallying the people. Their friend Viceroy Saruf agreed to help. Then, bam! Revolution. And that is how the interim government was born. Revolution, huh? Y'all did good. <laughs> but why the interim? Because once this war with Shinra's behind us, the whole country's gonna come together and decide what kind of government we want. Which is why we're doing everything we can to make sure the interim ends in independence. Pretty cool, right? Just gonna stand there? Let's get going! Interesting. That's how the first soldier comes into it. Interesting, interesting, interesting. But I feel like that's a good point to leave the game for now. So I'm going to drop a save. And that is where we're going to leave it. As I've said about a million different times. So, for those of you watching on YouTube, thank you very much for watching. Catch you next time.